I wish I could reach more people. Well, through the webpage, we are reaching people all over the world. And you need to reach particularly young people and encourage them that their point of view of being skeptical about things that have been pushed down their throat for generations, maybe they should be that skeptical and they should learn to think for themselves rather than just following the pack. And that's mm -hmm. what we're all about. Yeah. Now, of course, people can go to your webpage also. They can order your books and yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. various things of that nature. Yep. Um, and the foundation is hosting, I understand, a conference um, coming up. Yes, that'll be on January the 31st. It's coming January the 31st, going through February the 2nd. It'll be in Fort Lauderdale. If you look at the webpage, www.randy.org. Now, Randy is R-A-N-D-I, please note. Uh, you'll see the announcement of that. We're going to have some really interesting speakers. Mm. We've got the guy that wrote Bad Astronomy, for one thing, who fights the Fox TV network. Uh, when they say that we never landed on the moon. Right. Huh. And uh, I just as soon believe that Santa Claus is the real thing than believe that we didn't land on the moon. But uh, Phil Plate is a, is a great author and an astronomer, professional astronomer. He's going to be one of our speakers, but we've got a whole raft of them there, mm -hmm. including Michael Shermer from California, various other people. But look at the webpage and you'll see that. Great. Um, sort of to wrap this up, uh, I want to get your, your opinion. Um, how would you like to be remembered? Um, you know, when it comes bon to. Bon vivant? Yeah. <laughs> um, of fine wines? Snappy dresser? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, Tony, that's a good question. I'd like to be remembered as a, a guy who made a lot of noise about things that he believed people needed to know. And uh, that was, to a certain extent, successful. The young folks that I just met right here in this area mm. uh, are proof of that. If I only meet a couple of them because I show up in person, that means there are many hundreds of me, maybe thousands out there that I've reached in a similar way that can't get a chance to come to me and shake my hand and thank me for it. So uh, our purpose is to reach people like that. And I want to be known as the guy who, uh, a curmudgeon, if you will, certainly a mm -hmm. troublemaker and uh, a loud, raucous guy, uh, rather attractive in a, in a masculine way, but on the other hand, a fighter. I want to be known as a fighter. I want to be, it to be known out there that I never back down. I have never backed down ever, and I never will. I'm a fighter. I'll go right to the end. Well, that's great. I think we need more fighters, and we need more skeptical people out there. Thank you. And I thank you for the work that you've done and the work you're going to do for many more years to come. It's been a great pleasure. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on Spotlight on James Randi. I urge you to go and check out his website at www.randy.org and look for copies of his books there, videos, and other materials. Thank you for joining us.